Hey guys, so give you some uh, updates since the last time I decided to take a video. Um, I know it's been a few months and apparently I lost the video that I had up from August. But to clarify some things, on August 30th um, I had another appointment with my doctor, Heinz, and that was basically the day to discuss that. I am still going through the surgery as well as to get things progressed to go from it. So from there, he gave me some more updates, like how things are supposed to go on, blah, 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 and um, as well as, you know, consequences and basically everything about that. And we decided, you know, we picked the date, which is November 7th. Um, obviously, November 7th has got, come and passed. Um, so updates on that one. Um, on the 7th of November, obviously. I had my surgery, no actually no, before I did that, um, back in October, do not ask what day because I can't remember it, I had another uh, appointment uh, at the hospital just so, you know, like, just to discuss some stuff like, you know, my anesthesia and um, make sure that I'm like all healthy and blah blah blah, be ready for surgery. Um, so now caught to November 7th, um, updates from that, I uh, had my surgery which went pretty damn well. Um, I had to come into the hospital at 10.30 and, uh, if I start to fidget or whatever, I am so sorry, I am in so much pain. <laughs> I have the tubes in me still and I am so itchy on the top and I just don't know where to scratch. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's disgusting, but, yeah. Um, but yeah, like, we came in for 10.30, it was, like, literally, I got the number, I sat there for a bit, they called me, we discussed some stuff, and then got pulled into the other room. And got everything set, got my AV in. Um, doctor had to mark me. Pretty sure all my markings are gone. <clears throat> so I'm mostly like clogged up with the mucus and everything else. Yeah, sorry. Again, disgusting, I know. Um, but yeah, like it was, it went pretty damn fast. I had my iPod with me the entire time. I'm sorry I didn't make a video that day. Um, it wasn't really thinking, and especially because like I'm in a little cubicle thing. I didn't really want to do a video and people think like who the hell is she talking to? That type of thing. Um but it was like twelve o'clock. Like it was like I was sitting there for like an hour and a half or so and they got me downstairs for my surgery when which went pretty damn fast. Because <laughs> I wasn't really expecting it because like when I'm sitting there they got the uh stuff in me, they marked me up, he told me like, you know, I'm supposed to be off for a month. Now I told him that I booked myself off for two weeks. He said, Oh yeah, that's all I need time for. Yeah, the pain uh, is kind of coming through where it's like, do I really want to be uh, gone for two weeks and not the full month? But both of us, they kind of say, you know, like, we'll see how things play out. So we get to see how I am after my two weeks. And, you know, if I'm a little bit better, I'm going back to work. And if not, yeah. And that's basically what I'm doing for work will be, like, just take more. It's kind of like, hi, help me help you. Mainly for drive through I won't be able to take money because I'm still stretching. And, yeah. I really don't want to like uh, show that right now because that's going to hurt like a bitch. Um, sorry. <laughs> I'm on an iPod so it's kind of interesting. But yeah, like, my iPod literally just was like stuck to my side the entire time. Um, I took pictures. I was like so groggy. I literally woke up from my... Um, no, it was like, it's like a two and a half hour-ish um, surgery. I literally woke up. I turned to the nurse that was sitting there and I said to her, first thing out of my mouth, because I saw the mask on, so I was like really out of it, um, how did the surgery go? She's like, I wasn't there, but how I heard was it went pretty well. And I'm like, what time is it? It's like, well, it's 2.30. Those are the first things I said to her. <laughs> I was like, like that, I was so out of it, but those are the first two questions I asked her. So I basically had, uh, I shipped the, uh, right then, because like, I haven't, like, I hadn't had any water in me like the entire day so I was like so out of it and so drained um we got home that night and like I mom was like do you want some soup I'm like I'll attempt it I had banana that was pretty much it but like I had maybe two s teaspoons of uh soup and that was it I'm like I can't eat this I was like laying there I'm like just put me out of my misery right now um it's been like two days right now the tubes are like driving me insane so can't really see anything, but I am tinier than I had been. And then, where's my goddamn tubes? <laughs> this is it for the tubes. It's not that bad as uh, most people think. Like, I seriously thought it was going to be worse. 
than what it truly was because they were telling me, oh yeah, you know, you have two. I'm like, ew, like how am I supposed to drain them? Because I had no clue how they were supposed to be drained. They're not that bad. But I'm telling this to you guys right now, whoever gets surgery for breast reduction, please understand it is going to be a pain in the ass and you're going to be out of it for a couple of days. Um, you're going to be really sore and good luck moving. Because as you can see, I have my white nylons. I have to keep them on until I'm properly walking so I can get the normal blood uh, flow back into my legs. Because if I take them off right now, I can get blood clots, but, you know, who's to say? Um, but yeah, like, coming home, um, Wednesday, I literally was just, like, dragging, like, mom had to help me downstairs. Oh my god, that was the most hysterical thing we've ever had to do. Like, I'm there just going, oh my god. <laughs> it was fun, to say the least. Um... I was like so dependent on people that was like a couple of days like um on yesterday morning about three I had a, I woke up and I had to go to the washroom I'm like mom I because yeah this time I really cannot move I couldn't do anything so it was like I literally was like uh where's mom I have to go to the washroom um first thing I ate when I woke up that day donut <laughs> yeah that was my first meal I told it to the nurse, like, you just lost weight, you're allowed that. I'm like, awesome. <laughs> so, those are my uh, fun updates. Um, yeah, it was like after, like, yesterday I had, uh, by 11 I had scrambled eggs. Lunch I had, uh, McBites, which is a new chicken that we have at work. And, uh, had that, but I couldn't eat all the fries. I think it's because they were so cold. And then that night I finished the, uh, soup. And I just kind of been drinking, uh, ginger ale, Pepsi, and whatever. Just kind of get the, uh, caffeine into me. I finally had a tea after like three days of non-tea. Uh, don't do that to me ever. I need caffeine. Like, I need that tea I mean, at all times. Um, but yeah, like today so far I just had an almond. That's pretty much it. Um, but yeah, I've been basically on bed rest. I've been moving better on my own, but still can't move. Like when I walk, my arms are like this the entire time. It gets that bad. But you know, to say the least, it's. The surgery was well worth it, you know, because I no longer have the huge boobs, but the pain that comes with it, it, yeah, it sucks, but again, well worth it. So, I've been watching uh, Lord of the Rings for the past couple of days, finally got back onto movie two, which I've seen like multiple times, but I don't care. <laughs> kind of gave me something to do, and then I've been trying to write. Yeah, good luck getting me to write when I'm in pain and concentration goes out the window. I'm trying to get this uh, done for uh, National Novel Writing Month and I had to rewrite the first chapter all over again which pissed me right off. But yeah, other than that, like everything's been going well. I just cannot wait to get back into the shower because I can't shower until the tubes are out. And there was like one more, like I can't remember like, how it said, like the only way I can actually shower. My hair, I, I had to pull my, I had to brush my hair again today. It's like, ew, nasty. But, oh well. That's what I get for having surgery. So, that's my fun updates. And, yeah. This is actually the first time I've been sitting up properly. I'm in much across the right now. Um, pain. It's probably about like a five or a six right now. Just because the tubes are kind of like, at, like they're sitting like right here. And it actually hurts like a bitch. And today's my last day with the tubes. Yay! It's gonna hurt like a bugger. <laughs> like I'm literally just coming like laying there going, holy motherfucker, get them out. <laughs> I'm so sorry for the language, but that had to come out. So, yeah. Um, I'll do updates um, every week or wherever it needs to be. And we'll go from there. Alright, ciao guys. Bye.